Hi friends, today we'll talk about Saturn Rahu combination in your birth chart. If you have this combination, this video is for you. Now, what is this combination, friends? Either Saturn Rahu, they may be conjunct in one house, or Saturn and Rahu may aspect each other. Now, what are the various kinds of aspects that we consider in Bhrigun and Dinadi? Please watch that video where I have mentioned about all the various aspects which are considered in Prigunandi Nadi and I also take into consideration the aspects of Parashari Jyotish. So please watch that video friends. Now friends, uh, this is a very strange and interesting combination. In the initial part of his life, you know, especially until the age of 33 or 35, the native will be very much confused. He'll be in a state of confusion, especially in matters relating to his profession. He will be very confused. He will not know what decision to make, which way to go. So he will uh, not know what to do. This may happen. And friends, also it is seen that Saturn Rahu people, they may be in a state of illusion. Yes, they may be in a state of illusion because Rahu causes this illusion. They may not be able to come out of his, uh, come out of this state. They may believe something to be true, and they may run after something which is actually false. They may do that, and they have this tendency to be suspicious. Also, they don't trust anybody around them, and they are very suspicious, very skeptical by nature, and so they may suffer from a lack of self confidence also because they are in a state of delusion they are in a state of delusion uh, or they are in a state of illusion you can say illusion and friends rahu is a planet which also makes a person highly you know uh, intelligent also so such people they have great sharpness of mind they will be very good at technology any kind of technology friends whether it is hardware technology whether it is computer technology whether it is, you know, uh, any kind of technology, they will be excellent at technology, software technology, internet technology, online, whatever technologies are there, information technology, computer programming, they will be very good at ethical hacking, they'll be very good at coding, because Rahu makes the person very intelligent and he will use all his knowledge of technology in his business. Such people, they can be very good at investigation because they're very intuitive. They can be very good at any kind of investigation or research, such people. So friends, if Rahu is a benefit in the chart, then it may, you know, bless a person with growth and expansion in his professional life. That is also seen. And especially after the age of 35 years or after the age of 42 years, the native may also have multiple sources of income or at least more than one source of income he may have. So friends, Saturn-Rahu combination. This is a very interesting combination. As you know, friends, Rahu represents whatever is foreign. So such native, no, their profession may be connected to foreign land, to some foreign land, some foreign connection, foreign transaction will be connected to their profession. They may work in a foreign-based company, in a foreign multinational company. They may work there. Or because of their profession, they may have to undertake a lot of travel, a lot of foreign travel because of their profession or their business, whatever is their career. So they may have to undertake a lot of foreign travel if they have Saturn Rahu combination. And friends, we know that Rahu is any kind of, you know, attachment. Rahu is, you know, some is a planet which represents our desires also, unfulfilled desires. So such people, they'll be attached to their profession. They may even be emotionally attached to their profession. They'll be very much attached. There are a lot of desires attached to their profession. And friends, their profession may have to do with something that is signified by Rahu. Their profession may be connected to, you know, the to some to alcohol or wine. Because, you know, all these things are also connected to Rahu. So their profession may have to do with all these uh, things. You know, they may be uh, in the uh, alcohol industry. And also, friends, uh, you know, such people, they believe in black magic usually. So their profession also may be somehow connected to black magic or witchcraft. It may have some connection or, you know, as I told you, they may have uh, multiple sources of income. So they may also practice, uh, you know, black magic, necromancy, and, uh, you know, that may be their, uh, you know, part-time profession. And friends, if Rahu is benefic, then the native will be a very good tarot card reader. He'll be an excellent tarot card reader if Rahu is a benefic in the chart because a strong Rahu, you know, gives the native 
a strong power of intuition. He'll be highly intuitive and he'll be good at, you know, revealing someone's past, present and future. And he'll be able to look beyond reality and he'll be a very good psychic or a tarot card reader. He, he can go into any occult field and if any field of occult knowledge will be good for him if Rahu is strong in the chart and if Saturn is also well placed. So friends, we have seen that if Saturn is well placed, more or less, and if Rahu is also a benefit in the chart, then it will bless the native with growth and expansion in his profession. It will give him a lot of wealth, prosperity. It can give him miraculous growth and prosperity in life. But if Rahu is not a benefit, friends, and if Saturn is also ill-placed or afflicted, then it may cause the native's downfall. It may give him misery. It may make him very skeptical. It may make him go into depression. So this also may happen, friends.